This is the real Tom Rose, and we're dealing with a functions question here. And anytime time you deal with function questions, it's helpful to remember that each function has two components, an input and an output. As an example, let's look at the function that we've been given. f of x equals 5x minus 12. Now, the input is defined by the thing which is inside the parentheses. So in this particular function, the input will be this x right here. The output of the function will be whatever the whole function evaluates to. So 5x minus 12 will be the output. So the instructions that were given get a little nutty, but if you simply follow along verbatim and do what it says, the answer should come out. So let's go along and do that. It says, if 2 thirds f of r equals 12. Well, let's build that. We want 2 thirds f of r to equal 12. Now, f of r is a function. And right now, this is defined as output. Because we have the whole function, f of r. What's the input? The input is the r itself. So in the equation we were given originally for f of x, everywhere that there's an x, let's put an r in. So we'll end up with 2 thirds And here's f of x with r in place of x, 5r minus 12. And we want that to equal 12. Then the question becomes, what is the value of r? So we're asked to find r. And let's go about solving this. Let's multiply both sides by 3. And we'll end up with 2 times 5r minus 12 equals 36. Let's distribute the 2. So we'll end up with 10r minus 24 equals 36 add 24 to both sides and we'll have 10 R equals 60 divide both sides by 10 and we'll be left with R equals 6 which is answer choice D